guys welcome back to my channel my name is Christina for those of you who are new here and for all of my old time but goodies goody goody good as <laughs> I've always wanted to say that welcome back to my channel so um as you can tell by the title I'm going to be reviewing the new eco style um, gel it's the cannabis and sativa oil black castor oil and olive oil one and it's this one right here so I am recovering from a terrible weekend slash week so um, if I sound a little nasally that's that's why I'm, I was sick so I hope you guys enjoy this review and found it helpful Please continue to watch if you want to see my review on this product. This is what it says on the top. Alright, so it's going to start with this little section here in the back. Ugh, I really do not like this scent at all. I hope it doesn't linger because I don't want to be walking around smelling like, you know. Okay, camera. Rude. So this just has water in it. It's my old cream of nature bottle. My son always does something to my water bottles like i swear i feel like he just puts them in the trash because i can never find them once i see him with it i look i'm looking for it like a couple days later and i can't find it and two times that happened within the last couple of months so this is what i'm working with for now The slip on this is insane. I don't think I've had any Eco Styler gel that gives me this much slip. This is crazy. Like, I mean, Eco Styler, you know, it's like I've never used any that I don't like, but this one in particular. I don't know what they they got in it. Maybe it's the cannabis. So the clip that you just saw um, with, you know, the demo and stuff, that was last Friday. Today is Thursday. So it's been a whole week since I did that. And this is the same wash and go. I did refresh my hair a little bit. Um, uh, I want to say a couple days ago because, okay, right into that. So, okay, so I did refresh my hair. A couple days ago all I used was just water and a little bit more of gel in areas where I'm prone to frizz like up here get really frizzy very easily and I lose curl definition so that's all I did no leave-in condition no not leave-in conditioner no nothing um, so first thing I would say um, they raised their price because this is a small container and I used to be able to get a small container like this for like two something or maybe three something depending on where I go. And this container is $6.99. So, and I know the one that they had before, which is in the 
the gold, the Eco Style Gold one, that one was pretty pricey too. So they've been raising the prices, which I mean, it's still pretty affordable, so it's fine. Um, so pros on this, I, it's very, it has a lot of slip, very, very slippery. Um, all Eco Style gels usually glide through my hair, but I don't know what is the difference with this one. This one has, I noticed the slip is way different from the other one. So the slip is really, really nice. Um, my hair does, did not get dry at all. Um, it did give me a hold, a nice hold, but my hair was never dry. It didn't feel like dehydrated or anything like that. I love the way it made my hair feel over, you know, the days, even up until I refreshed it. The claims that I have on here, I, I don't know if I can, let's not even go there. Because I can't see growth, I can't see this nourishing my hair, I can't see that it's adding body because my hair always looks like this with just about every gel that I use. Now, the cons, I hate the smell. As I mentioned before, it smells like a smoker who put perfume on after smoking. I hate it. I hate when I walk past people and they smell like they just smoked a whole bunch of cigarette or whatever, black and mild or whatever people smoke, and they just spray cigarette on it. Um, cigarette spray cologne on it stinks. And this is exactly what this reminds me of. Like I, I am for some people, it might be different, but that's what it smells like. Smoke and um, cologne stinks. Um. But the good thing is the scent does not linger. After my hair dry, I couldn't smell it. Thank goodness, because I do not want to smell like this. The biggest con is the flaking. This gel flakes like crazy. It looks like dandruff is raining from scalp to tip. Like, it's really bad. I'm gonna see if I can come in closer and show you guys what I'm talking about. And that's the reason why I refreshed my hair a few days ago because I wanted to see if I can get rid of some of the flaking. I didn't have time to wash my hair. Um, so I was like, let me just spritz it down with some water. I sprayed down with water and I kind of rubbed everything, you know, I guess the gel that was in it reactivated and all that stuff. But after it was dry and everything, it came back and I noticed flaking on the second day. So you see all the little white white it's everywhere and as soon as I touch my hair it's like showering my clothes so if I wear anything black or dark it looks terrible even if I scratch my hair and um, that alone with the smell is like a huge turn off I am gonna try to use this again because I do have you know I do have quite a bit left so I'm gonna try to, and I'm not gonna throw it away. I paid seven dollars and some change for this thing. So I'm gonna do another wash and go, but this time I'm not gonna use a butter because I did use a butter as a moisturizer. I'm gonna use like a a spray, like a light light spray kind of leave-in conditioner, and see if that makes a difference. Um, if it doesn't, I'm just gonna stay away from this one. But if it does make a difference, then I know not to use this particular one with any butters. Um, I hope you guys found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are not a subscriber. And if you have any requests, um, leave them in the description box. I'll try to get to them as soon as possible. Just keep in mind that I am a full-time nursing student. I am a mother. I am a wife. I have other responsibilities outside of all of that so and on you know youtube so just bear that in mind i can't do so many videos and so if you guys request stuff and it seems like oh my goodness she's never gonna do it it's not because i'm not gonna do it sometimes i just have to do a video that's easier to film and edit than something that's going to take you know longer time because usually i don't have time to do much so um, I just wanted to let you guys know that so Thank you so much again for all the support and I'll see you guys in my next video